Hello students. Today I am here with another organic conversion. Today's organic conversion is ethanol to methylamine. Now here you can see that methylamine having only one carbon and ethanol has two carbons. So that means in this conversion we have to remove one carbon from the starting material. So now let's explore how we can convert ethanol to methylamine. If we we'll oxidize ethanol using a strong oxidizing agent like KMnO4 or Jones reagent, CH2OH will be converting to carboxylic acid, say acetic acid. Now when we treat acetic acid with thionyl chloride, COOH group, this carboxylic acid group will be converted to COCl. It is acetyl chloride. Now if we add ammonia in acetyl chloride, we get acetamide. So this reaction is very simple to understand. Like here, this is CH3COCl. And this one is ammonia molecule. So this Cl and hydrogen is leaving like a HCl molecule. And we are getting a compound CH3C double bond O NH2. So this one is amide functional group. C double bond O NH2. This is amide functional group. Now when we treat amide, acetamide with bromine sodium hydroxide, we get methylamine. So this reaction is called Hobman degradation reaction because in this reaction here you can see one carbon is degraded like number of carbon atoms are less from the starting material. So this is the way we can get ethanol to ethyl amine. This is a very simple but important organic conversion. I hope students are able to understand each and every steps and it will be helpful for their study and exam preparation. You can share your comments and feedback in the comment section. You also can write me down that which kind of organic conversion you are looking for. Definitely I'll be making those videos to help your exam preparation. So don't forget to subscribe my channel Chemistry Affinity to get updated with various videos related to chemistry. Thank you for watching this video.